神灵一样的祖先呐、啊，请给我一些指示吧。In the Shang Dynasty capital of Dai Shang, King Wu Ding seeks approval from the ancestors for his marriage to Hao. To obtain their answer, the diviner inserts a heated poker to crack the ox bone. This is a fragmentary turtle shell that was specially prepared for the divination ceremony. If you look at the back of the shell, you can see the specially prepared notches that were cut into the back, and it was the application of heat in these hollowed areas on the back of the bone that actually caused the bone or the shell to crack. The way the bone cracks will show the ancestor's answer. The diviner insists that the ancestors disapprove of the king's forthcoming marriage to Hao. The divination did not always lead to a clear answer. Uh, the diviner could have been involved in interpreting the cracks. The king could have been involved in interpreting the cracks. Princess Hao intervenes. She knows the diviner tampered with the bone. She spots another crack with a quite different outcome. A sign that her marriage will bring good fortune. The system certainly, to modern eyes, appears that it could have been manipulated. From now on, how is assured she will become a queen? The outcome is inscribed in the bone. Over 50,000 Shang oracle bones were discovered in Anyang. The 3,000-year-old inscriptions record the story of Fu Hao, King Wu Ding, and the history of the Shang dynasty. You can see the crack, and you can also see the inscriptions that narrate the subject of the divination ceremony. The characters are very pictographic. You can see a depiction of a four-legged animal down here in the corner. Jia Guo is the oldest of the Cheng Wen Wenxian. So, as a Wenxian, it is not just a few words. It is the culture. It is the culture behind the many rich knowledge. Politics, technology, and even the religion. 包括那时候的宗教信仰。